Hey everyone, take a look at the Denon DJ SC Live 4 running Serato 3.0. And I've got this thing running on a Steam Deck that's running Windows 11. Shout out to Drew for giving me the idea and telling me how well this thing works. So I thought I'd run out and grab one of these bad boys. Took a little bit to install Windows 11, just a YouTube video and a little bit of time. Nothing too difficult. And you know what? This thing runs incredibly good. Let me give you a quick demonstration here. Look at the frame rate on that thing, how smooth it is compared to the SC Live 4. And it runs stems really well. Trying not to get any copyright strikes here because, uh, you know, I like to make a couple of bucks on this thing if I can. So let me just turn down the volume here and stop these things for a quick sec. And you're going to see this thing works really, really well because we've got mouse pad right there. I can go into my settings because Serato was never great for touch screens for some reason. Always had issues with the Microsoft Surface Pro trying to use a touch screen. And um, go into the library here. And let's just make that a little bit bigger. Jump out of there. And um, you can always pop that into library mode if you want to just use that for your library and run all your waveforms here. But um, yeah, and you can see there's a little bit of a delay. Not really much to be honest because I've got way more screen real estate here to be looking at things load up a deck here and um analyzes through pretty quick this is coming off beat port link now it takes a couple minutes not a couple minutes but a few seconds because you can see how long that took before I had my stems in there, but it load up stems pretty damn fast, man, considering it's coming off a streaming service on top of it, too. Anyways, I'm not going to make this video super long. If you want to know how to do this, it's super simple. Just get yourself a Steam Deck. Look up the tutorials online of how to install Windows 11. And uh, you're just installing Serato. This is really super simple. The only thing I'm going to have to do, you only have one USB port on this thing, so... I'm going to have to get a splitter to see is it possible to run power to this thing as well as um, hooking up the controller. That's the only thing I got to consider. Other than that, this thing's great. Anyways, my friends, talk to you all later. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I need the subscribers. It definitely helps. And uh, hit the alert button because you know what? You need to know when I'm making new videos so I can show you the newest and coolest stuff. Talk to you all soon.